Hello everyone and welcome back to a new part of Dragon Ball Z Team Training. When we last left off, we added Nappa and Shiatsu to our team, and right now we're in Mount Moon on our way to Namek Town, so hopefully we'll meet some more powerful fighters on our way there. So, let's, uh, this is another ladder, so I guess there's another encounter waiting for us here. Yes, another member of the Team Pilaf uh, gang. We're pulling a big job here. Get lost, kid. I mean, did you look in the mirror? I think you're a... <laughs> you're a dog yourself. <laughs> a cute dog, also. So, you have a bear thief. Now, unfortunately... My only way is... Switch training with Goku right now, since he's the only one who has... A decent moveset that takes the opponent down in one shot. That caused uh, more damage than I would like, actually. So I don't have to make a lot of trips back to the healing center. A Cyberman. Yeah, let's give it to our Nappa again. And let's switch with... Goku again. Now Goku is the only one with the uh, Kaioken Rush and Kamehameha that can take the enemy down in one or two shots maximum. Um, I, re I really need my other team to uh, level up and learn some new movesets. I was hoping at level 10 he would learn something new, but that did not happen. So, you're good! Yes, we're very good! This is Goku we're talking about! We found an Everstone. I don't think I'm gonna use an Everstone in this game, since I want to see the evolutions of all the fighters. Everstone prevents uh, evolution of fighters, so I don't think I'm gonna use it. Now I'm going to reserve our HP for trainers like this one here. Did you come to explore the cave too? Actually no, I came to um, go through the cave to Namek Town. So I'm more interested in... Oh, Krillin! I'm more interested in crossing the cave and not exploring the cave. Um, let's tail smash Krillin. What is that? Oh, Evasiveness Rose. Okay, I thought it was something else. <laughs> and he still gets uh, Tail Smashed. Come on, Krillin, that won't work against Nappa. And one more. Oh, we nearly did it uh, damage free. <laughs> yeah, nice work, Nappa. I am sure. Let's keep Nappa in. Guard. Okay, we can take you down, it's just gonna take a while. As long as you don't deal damage, that... <gasps> a critical hit! Okay. Okay, luck is with you today, Nappa. Etienne, let's keep Nappa in, but this time I'm gonna switch to someone else. So let's give you to our Piccolo or Raditz. Let's give Piccolo a chance. We are going to Namek Town. Nice. Hopefully this next attack will take you down. Oh, hang on by a thread! And we level the both up! So, very nice! Losing stinks! It's so uncool! Well, but you learn from it, so... You're still a youngster, you will learn that lesson. Hmm. 
Now, let's see... This next trainer? Whoa, you shot me! Oh, you're just a kid! What does that mean? I mean, we're gonna make you lose regardless. So, let's switch to our Goku. And use Kami. Kami. Ha! Nice. Takes you down in one. A Reddit. Yes. Let's give you to our own Reddit. So, Tail Smash. Oh, nice. Nice work, Reddit. And the Nappa. Do we give him to our own Nappa? No, let's keep uh, our Reddits in. And one more will take him down. Nice work, team. Wow, shocked again. Yeah. So I think, yeah, there's a capsule here. A moonstone. Now there's a topic I want to talk to you about. What I read up uh, about this ROM hack, what a moonstone is good for. And apparently, if you use it on a Saiyan, uh, he, he transforms into an Uzaru, which is the great ape. Uh, so I think here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to catch a Nappa in this uh, part of the cave right here. And I'm going to use the moonstone on it. So we have our own Uzaru. How about that? And we add him to the team. I don't know if he will stay long term, but that's an addition I would like to see in, in our team. That is supposed to be a monster, you know? So there's the Nappa. I'm not gonna use my own Nappa for uh, using the Moonstone on. Let's use a wild Nappa like that one. Well, it depends. Let's see his moveset as well. Now, I don't want you to faint. Will that work? Oh, it made you faint. Sorry about that. We need to be careful with our next encounter then. Okay. Level 8. So, oh, one more and... Then we use our caps. Oh, and you made our Nappa faint. Okay, I did not realize that. Sorry about that, Nappa. Now let's use Piccolo. Now, in the bag, we have a capsule. Let's catch you, sir. Yes. No, there is no need. So, in the bag. Uh, no, before that, let's check the moveset of our newly caught Nappa. Do you have something new in your arsenal? Punch and Tail Smash. No, the same moveset. So, there, let's see here. Item. How do we use Moonstone exactly? I forgot about that part. Okay, we go to here. Moonstone. A peculiar stone that makes certain fighters evolve. It's as black as the night sky. So, let's use it. Huh, we can use it on our Saiyans. Not Goku, because he lost his tail, if you remember. So, on this Nappa, let's see what happens. Moonstone was used on Nappa. What? Nappa is evolving! I never 
dreamed of saying those words ever. <laughs> I vault into Uzaru, the great ape. And he looks amazing too. Wow, let's check that uh, that Uzaru of ours. Oh, look at that sprite. It, he almost takes two spaces. Summary. Lowers the foe's attack by his intimidation. Okay. Punch and tail smash. So you learn the same moveset as the Nappa you came from. Okay, but maybe later on you will learn some new movesets. Okay, duly noted. Let's put you up front for right now to train you up. Let's see if you're a true monster. <laughs> Our first encounter is... Uzaru versus Nappa. So, let's use Tail Smash. Okay, our defense is strong. And our attack is strong as well. I mean, this is the first time um, the same level fighters. Yeah, and we dominate like that. Very nice. We need it to be always levels higher. So he is a monster. We just have to give him time and uh, in order to evolve. One crystal. What's a crystal? Is it something to sell? A crystal that revives a fainted fighter, restoring HP by half the maximum amount. Okay, I'm not going to use it right now. Let's keep it with us. Go, Zaru. <laughs> oh, can't escape? Maybe that's what uh, I focus is for. Okay. Well, in that case, can I switch? To our rabbits? Yeah, I will try to take you down. As long as you're not causing any damage points, that works for us. Training our Uzaru, who apparently is going to be a real monster. Okay, can't wait for him. I wonder if he evolves again. I think they do. I think the Uzaru evolves again. That's a scary thought when you think about it. <laughs> So, let's see what you have, uh, little grunt. You have two fighters, one of them is Cyberman, level 13 though, against our hurting Uzaru, so lucky for you, he's not ready just yet to devour you. Now let's go to Goku? Yeah. Oh, that critical hit though, that's not good. Our HP for Goku is uh, very low, I don't like that. Uzaru grew to level 9. No, let's keep uh, Goku in to finish this fight very quickly. Okay, very nice. Took him down in one. I need the rest of the team to learn moves like that. Come on. I'm Steam. <laughs> so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna quick transition, return back to the healing center and return back to this same spot. So I'll be right back. Okay, we're back guys. Uh, but on the way back here, something happened that I wanted to tell you. Uh, Goku leveled up, and while he leveled up to level 16, he started to evolve. 
and I stopped his evolving process so that I can get it on screen with you guys. So he evolves at level 16. I have no idea what he evolves to. My personal opinion is going to be super same, form 1. Um, but we need to wait until level 17. I, I, I decided to wait until you see it with me. So right now I put Goku up front. But I'm not going to um, waste his points against those weaker enemies. Hopefully we will uh, take our next opponents very quickly, so the experience points all go to Goku and we can see his evolved form. That would be awesome. Yeah, something important like that I didn't want to happen off screen, you know? So our next encounter I believe is going to be on the left side of this pathway. So the good thing about this is that we can escape easier since uh, Goku is up front like that. And we have our next encounter. We, Team Pilaf, shall find the Dragon Balls. We'll be able to have all we want. Well, what I want is enough experience points to evolve our Goku with one level. Can you do that for us, sir? Now, Kaiu can rush. Oh, you hang, you hung on by a thread. Okay, decent amount of experience points there. And one more time. Oh, come on, sir. You paralyzed our Goku? That's not good. And you cause a lot of damage with that attack. Why? And you even did not give us enough experience points. Now I'm mad. That's my line. Oh well. So, uh, I can use items outside of battle, so let's do just that. I will use a Paralyze heal for our Goku. And do we have an Onigiri? Yes, we do. So let's give it to Goku as well. Yeah, Goku likes his food, of course. <laughs> so I think we have our next encounter up here. <gasps> that's one of the Dragon Balls. Hey, stop. I found this ball. That's mine. Well, if I have to fight you for it, sir, I will. You have Piccolo. Well, we have Goku. <laughs> and we're gonna use Kaioken Rush. That nearly took you out in one shot, sir. Now, let's use regular punch. And hopefully that will take us to the next level. Super Saiyan level. Oh, no. So close, though. So close. So against turtles, let's use Kaiu can rush once more. Yes, took you down in one. Now are we level 17? Yes, we are. A Jiren, so let's switch fighters now. Let's give the Jiren to our Uzaru. Yeah, let's see uh, what level are you. Level 12. And you're intimidated by us, as you should, sir. Decreasing our attack power. Let's see if that works. Oh, we missed our attack. So let's punch you then. Hmm. 
that can take a while. Okay, let's keep tail smashing until we bring you down, sir. I mean, we are level 9 and we're fighting head-to-head <laughs> uh, -head with a level 12 Jiren. Uzaru is a... Uh, going to be a powerhouse, I can't wait. Yeah, <laughs> took him down! Damn, I lost! Yes, you did, sir. Now give us our Dragon Ball. But before that, first, Goku is evolving! I never thought I would say those words. <laughs> Congratulations! Goku evolved into Super Saiyan Goku! <laughs> no! My precious ball! Anyway, maybe it's yours now, but one day Pilaf will take it from you. I knew that this ball would bring some problems, but you'll finally be the one in trouble. Well, I don't care what you say, sir. I'm going to get that Dragon Ball. Now let's see our Super Saiyan Goku! Hello! <laughs> now, what did I want? You didn't learn new moves. Okay, so... Now, let's see your information. Here's the Super Saiyan form of Goku. It's supposed to be a legend, but many Saiyans can reach this level. Well, but there is only one Goku. Uh, let's put someone else up front now. <laughs> let's put Ozaru. And that will take us out of the Mount Moon area. Wait, there was supposed to be the duo here of Mega Punch and Mega Kick. They're not here. Okay, so this is also different. And... This is supposed to be another color, if I remember correctly. This is blue. So maybe that's because it's... Namikian? Speed up. Okay, we are not gonna use that move. Let's check this uh, patch of grass. Who do we have? A new fighter that we want? Who is that? Nail? Do we want Nail? Hmm, no. Who else do we have? A Piccolo. So, since this is Namek Town, I guess all the encounters here are going to be Namekians. So we have Nail and Piccolo. Anyone else? One more encounter and then we will go to the town itself. No, so we only have Nail and Piccolo. Okay, duly noted. So let's head to the town and see. The water is green. <laughs> and the people are green. So those are Namikians. Welcome to Namek Town, where humans and Namekians are friends! <laughs> we Namekians have created this blue earth with Namek seeds, so that we can live in the same conditions as in our native planet. This is awesome from the creators of, of this ROM hack to do this. My husband likes trading fighters. You're collecting fighters, aren't you? Would you please trade with him? Oh... Hello there, do you happen to have Frieza? Freezer? It's written wrong or am I... And if I have Frieza, why would I trade it with you? What do you have? Would you agree to a trade for my cooler, his brother? Oh. Well, we don't have Frieza, but if I have Frieza, I don't think I'm gonna get cooler, sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna keep Frieza. 
if I have them. Um, let's heal up at the Poké Center. It's not a Poké Center. <laughs> I made that mistake again. It's a Heal Center now. Thank you, Nurse Joy. This town is a peaceful place, but I've heard that thieves are wandering around. I hope they won't disrupt us. Okay, I hope so too, but they seem uh, mild. Why don't you go upstairs and try trading fighters with your friends? Um, we, no. Muri is the chief of this little Nemekin village. Okay. And what do you have to tell us, sir? Have you heard about Leon? Everyone thinks he's crazy. I think people are just jealous of him, though. Which Leon? Final Fantasy VIII or Resident Evil 2 and 4? Which Leon are you referring to, sir? So this is the gym. You're a trainer too? Battling, trainer. It's a tough life, isn't it? Well, but I love it. That's why we're here. If you want to visit the other towns, you should take Route 5 or Route 9. Okay. Looks like heaven. <laughs> we wish. What do you have to offer, sir? So, do you want more capsules? We have 12 already, so no. We want more onigiri, definitely. Yeah, uh, to use outside of battle. So, let's buy 9 to get 10 total. Um, Paralyze heal, yes. Let's buy... Oh, it's expensive. Let's buy 4 of those. Awakening, burn heal. I mean, Awakening is not that bad, so burn heal I, is not that bad either. Repel. Do we use Repel? Not in this game, I don't think so, because I want to catch um, all the fighters I can. So, yeah. I don't know what kind of fighters we're gonna face, so if I use Repel, I may never know. Ah, too much time, too little to do. Is nothing entertaining happening anywhere? This is Dragon Ball Z Universe, sir. I'm sh pretty sure that there is something important happening somewhere. I want a bright red bicycle. I'll keep it at home so it won't get dirty. Yeah, this is the bicycle shop. Is it still as expensive as the Pokemon games? <laughs> yeah, one million dollars. Yeah, we're definitely uh, not buying it right now. So we entered here, this is the Fraser person. Only skilled trainers can collect dragon badges. I see you have at least one. Oh, this is the person who tells us about the badges benefits? Um, no need. This is the area, I have no idea why, why is it coded in the game, Pokemon game or Dragon Ball for that matter. I concoct a variety of medicine from berry powder. Using good berry powder I can make any kind of medicine. Now tell me, have you any interest in berries? Let's say yes. Why must you lie to me? What? How many berries do you have? Not a one. Oh, so you need me to carry a berry to continue our conversation. Got it. Hi, Officer Jenny. The people here were robbed. It's obvious that Team Pilaf is behind this most heinous crime. Even our police force has trouble with them. Okay, Officer Jenny, nice meeting you. And this is the gym. Namek Town Gym, Leader Mui. The Namekian Chief. So you know what, I'm going to end the video right here. And I think before the start of the next video, I'm going to level up my team. Maybe all to level 17 or maybe 18 before attempting to fight in this gym. So, uh, I will do this training off screen. I will meet you then. So, thank you all for sticking with me on this part. And I will see you next part. Goodbye.